Today's question comes from John in Las Vegas who asks, which shoulder exercise is better, regular overhead press or behind the neck overhead press? John, I've got a bottle of one of our Vortex with your name on it. No, literally, it's got your name on it. So let's jump into the question with the clock starting now. There's some awesome old school exercises that sometimes unfortunately get forgotten, and then there are the ones that should be forgotten, but always seem to resurface. Behind the neck barbell presses fall into that latter category. When doing a barbell shoulder press, also called a military press, most of the stress is on the front delts and some on the side delts. Guys start doing behind the neck presses in an effort to put more emphasis on the side delts so that you get more shoulder width. Now here's the problem, in order to do this movement, it requires maximal external rotation of the shoulder, placing unnecessary stress on the rotator cuff, muscles, tendons, and ligaments. In other words, you're going to injure your shoulder. Instead of doing them behind the neck, make your military presses more effective by using better technique. Too many times I see guys sliding down and arching their back. This makes it easier because you're engaging more of your chest to help press it, but in the process, you're putting more emphasis on your front delts and none on the side. To correct this, sit upright, keep your forearms parallel with your torso. Now time's up, make sure to come back every Tuesday and Thursday for new videos or visit bpisports.net. Go to this link to submit your question and you may even get a month's supply of BPI Sports products. For more tips, follow me on Facebook at James Grage Fitness or on Instagram at James Grage Fit.